Quarterback Dak Prescott. Do it again. Yeah. Quarterback Dak Prescott. Okay, Dak. So here at the Belt Bowl, what's been your um, favorite thing that you guys have done since y'all been here? Uh, I mean, I've enjoyed just the town, just uh, the city in general. I've just, uh, I've liked how the the Belt Bowl, the Belt Bowl committee have just given us a lot of time off, just to enjoy ourselves, not bugging us down with a, uh, a lot of events and uh, hanging out at the Epicenter. I think that's a, that's a great place. How everything is all together in one. Uh, but I'm a guy, I love the game of football, I love practicing, I love practicing at that high school stadium, I can't tell you why, uh, it's just different, uh, but yeah, I've, I've enjoyed that, yeah. Not too big to go back to high school. Right? No, not at all, and I always think it's, fun, think it's fun to throw the ball around, play somewhere different, play somewhere you, you never would, I guess you can say, so playing, yeah, playing out there in the high school, it's fun. You know, uh, I guess going back to the high school field and practicing, I mean, I guess that just kind of reminds you of the innocence. Yeah, and, I mean. And at that point in time what it was like just to play high school football. Exactly, and I think that may be why I like it that much, uh, just why I've enjoyed going out there and practicing on the field. I've uh, just remind you of where you come from, uh, all the games that, that got you here to this university, uh, on those little fields, on the, in those little stadiums like that. So uh, it's cool to go out there. I uh, know probably the last time I'll ever play in a stadium that small or practice in a stadium that small, whichever. So, yeah, it's awesome. You know, that's, that's pretty neat to hear that, you know, the game, you know, as big as it is, you know, I'm sure, you know, it, Mississippi State, I mean, you know, crowd rocking. I mean, right. You're playing in some of the largest venues in the country. And uh, you guys are ranked, what, number one? Was that last year? Last year, year right. Last year. Yep. You have it all that. So, what to hear you talk about playing or practicing in a high school stadium and being a guy who's really on the cusp of going to the NFL and how you appreciate just going back. Yeah, I mean, I appreciate the game of football so much. So every aspect that goes into it is uh, special to me. And uh, so, I mean, I'm excited for my last game, like I said. Uh, I'm, it's just been an exciting moment, I guess, all together, uh, realizing that everything I've done the last couple of years is coming down to one last game. So. Right, 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 right here. You can see the, see the light. Exactly. I mean, want to go out with a win, make sure uh, – I finished my last game on the Coach Mullen, the last game in the uh, maroon and white uh, of Mississippi State jersey and with these brothers uh, as with the win. So. Fantastic. So now for tomorrow, you know, we know that, you know, unfortunately, like me with my cameras and stuff, right, I don't like always rain and stuff, right. man. So going into a game like tomorrow, knowing that the team is going to be with it raining, is there any specific types of, or different types of preparations you would do? Uh, no, I'm going to treat my hands as you would treat your camera, try to keep it dry. Uh, <laughs> And I'm going to just go out there, try not to worry about it, try not to think about it. And uh, usually you have success when you don't think about the weather and you just grip the ball normal as you normally would, let it go. Don't grip it too tight or try to adjust for the weather and just go out there and play ball. Usually It usually works. And we've played in some wet games this year, so we've got experience with that. Okay. Well, good. All right. Well, thanks very much. Oh, yeah. Appreciate it.